Tonight, a Tunica family finally has answers years after their loved one disappeared in Memphis. And while they're not the answers the family was hoping for, they say they're thankful to finally have some closure. WRG's Ashley Paul is here live tonight after talking to that family. And Ashley, today was pretty emotional for them. It certainly was, Shay, especially for the mother of David Pollard, who says while she's grateful to be able to lay her son to rest, she's desperate to know what happened to him. Help me, Jesus. I prayed all this year. An emotional plea from Lulu Pollard to find out what happened to her son. All I want to do is find out what they did. What Oh, Lord. She was too emotional to talk to us, but other family members say Lulu's son, David Pollard, was always there to offer a smile. He made you laugh. Every time he came around, like, you're going to get a laugh out of him. He used to make me laugh all the time. Police say Pollard was reported missing back in May of 2021 in the area of New Willow Road in East Memphis. Family members say it wasn't unusual for him to go off the grid for a few months at a time, but he always came back. Once it passed them certain amount of months that he didn't come around and we didn't see him, then we got we started wondering like where is he? We have not seen him, and we start we, we knew something was wrong. Police say they found his body in Westwood in April of 2022, but he was only positively identified last week. Family members say this is the first they heard about Pollard's whereabouts. When we checked, they said we don't have a David Pollard, so he basically he was a John Doe. So we didn't know, you couldn't explain, he didn't have no ID, no anything on him. So tonight they have closure, knowing they can finally lay him to rest. But they still seek justice because police say this was a homicide, but they don't know who is responsible. Don't think y'all done got away. We're going to get just to serve. And now police are asking anyone with any information to call Crime Stoppers at 528-CASH. I'm Ashley Paul, WREG News Channel 3.